it is a pleasure for me to give a welcome address at this General Assembly of the International Union of Geodesy and Geophysics. To do that, let me share with you a short presentation about this International Year of Basic Sciences for Sustainable Development in 2022-2023 under the auspices of UNESCO, which, of which I am the president. And it is on behalf of this International Year that I am giving this welcome address. The rationale behind this International Year, I think cannot be better shown than with this very short video made by CERN, starring in it, my grandniece, uh, Eloise Goldberg, 13 years old. Thank you. Curiosity about the world around us is what makes us human. This desire to make sense of the world is the driving force behind fundamental science. Stirred by this curiosity, each new generation of scientists adds to the pool of knowledge built up by previous generations. We are at a crucial time for the future of our planet. Now, more than ever, it is imperative to use this pool of knowledge to help solve the global problems we face and pave the way for a more sustainable development. And we must not stop being curious. Future generations will be inspired by the knowledge we contribute today, equipping them with the powerful tools they need to build a better world. To uh, give some examples uh, to illustrate this video, uh, I have listed a few uh, uh, examples. Vaccines and treatments against COVID-19 are full of basic biology DNA. The web was born at CERN from the needs of fundamental science. Google research engine comes from a brilliant mathematical IT. Artificial intelligence relies on statistical methods. Cellular phones are full of transistors, integrated circuits, Wi-Fi code. GPS relies on Einstein theory of relativity and on quantum atomic clocks. The Genome Project has opened the way to gene therapies. PET scan and MRI are based on antimatter physics and fundamental atomic magnetism. Generation and storage of renewable energy depends on advances in physics, chemistry, and material science. Reduction in pollution and green chemistry rely on basic advances in chemistry. The second quantum revolution is having now applications. And last but not least, the science of plate tectonics has revolutionized the knowledge about our planet. The outcome of this international year can be a little bit summarized by this statement. Basic sciences are curiosity and inquiry driven. They are the foundations of education and the sources of discoveries which turn into applications. They can then serve an inclusive sustainable development, improving global equity and well being together with a healthy and lively planet. All together, education, discoveries, applications, and inclusive sustainable development can boost collaborative and open basic sciences. This is the virtuous circle that we want to promote during the International Year of Basic Sciences for sustainable development and after. To achieve this goal, we shall need you, teachers, scientists, entrepreneurs, and society at large to share this vision and act accordingly. A decade of sciences for sustainability might be necessary. We are trying to get this international decade proclaimed by the United Nations General Assembly. And finally, I want to thank you and we can count on you, and yes, we can. Thank you very much, and have a very fruitful General Assembly in Berlin. Thank you.